everybody, it's Dawn, and welcome to my channel, Say La Vie. Um, oh, I guess we have an appearance from Smokey. We are trying to teach these kittens to stay off the counters and the tables, but, you know, like children, it's a little bit of a learning, right? You're not allowed on the table. Anyway, jumping in, I have a Dollar Tree haul to share with you guys. Some of the stuff you guys have seen, just because I haven't had a chance to get it up and show you guys. The next two weeks are crazy busy, crazy busy, crazy busy. My oldest graduates, and we've got that. And anyway, so we're going to jump right into the hall. Say bye, Smokey. Say bye. And he'll probably be back. So I'm just going to jump right in now. Okay, uh, starting with food, uh, any edible stuff um, that's not pantry related would be gone because when you have sons, they eat. Well, any kids eat, but all my boys eat. But I do want to show you. So I am out of, so I, I can my own tomatoes and make sauces at canning season. But again, going back to this, my family eats. All my tomatoes and all my sauces are gone. So until canning season starts, I've resorted to having to buy stuff. Now we like Posada. Posada are strained tomatoes and they, um, why we like them is because the only ingredients in here are tomatoes, salt, citric acid. So basically this is when you're canning a tomato sauce, this is all it is, citric acid, lemon juice, it's just your acid to preserve it. So we really like Posada and then I can make homemade sauces with this until I can make my own. This was a, oh, obviously everything in Canada is $1.25. Forgot I was doing Dollar Tree. And Unico is a great brand. Um, normally at the grocery store that I go to, these will go on sale for $1.99 and then I will buy a case then. So for $1.25, you betcha, I bought a case of this. So I love Posada. I also found these Classico Reserva 650 mil roasted garlic and we've been into this and this is actually really good so we got I got 20 of these and then they have the only other kind I could find was uh, I'm not Italian guys but I'm gonna try Arabiata um, and that is your spicy your spicy uh, one so I only bought I think four or six of these for hubby and I and depending on the heat now my kids will eat some heat just depends on how hot but hubby and I love heat and I like Classico as well because no preservatives no added sugar I don't like sugar in my sauces and I know that's kind of contrary because a lot of people put sugar in their sauces when they're making them but I don't like sweet sauces so got those that's basically the only food items that are left okay I got uh, these stickers. They're just uh, the graduation. There's lots of them out there, but I'm just going to make my son and my nephew, who's also graduating, a little card. So I just got those stickers to make them each a card for their grad. I got these jumbo paper clips with the pom poms, mainly because of this one, but. They're really cool and they're nice. They're nice big pom poms. So I really like those. I found the deco tape, the seven piece deco tape in this color. Now there's one out there that I'm still looking for and I'll have to try some other Dollar Trees that have more of the, like it's more, way more pinks, which is more me. But to have this size deco tape and to get seven of them for $1.25, yes please. So I got that. And that's by Jot. Now, this is a, <laughs> this is a, okay, anyway, can't talk today. I got these, the Mod Podge in the mat. Now, I have huge Mod Podge bottles from, oh, different places. I got one at a thrift store last summer, and it's, it's a big jar, bigger than this, I think, and I paid two bucks for it, and when I was at Dollar Tree, I'm like, I don't have any of the mat. I thought mine were all glossy. Then I got home and I realized mine are matte. So now I have two extra mats. So these will probably go out in friend mail or gifts or anything like that because I have so much matte and I will go back and get the glossy. I mean, you would not believe how much Mod Podge I have. So yeah, these might go out in friend mail or gifts or yeah, we'll see. 
Okay, um, I got these binder clips just for my craft room. Um, things like this disappear, and I do have the little tiny ones, but I didn't have any of this size for holding projects and things like that. So anyway, you get eight pieces, so I got that. Sorry, my battery's saying it's low and it's on a, it's on a battery case. I'm not sure what's going on. Let's hope I can make the video. Uh, we have a bulletin board again above my, again. We have a bulletin board above my kids' cubbies in my laundry room. And again, the push pins disappear. So I just, there's a pack of 80 black goes with everything in that room. So just got those for the, the bulletin board. The, I call it like this school planning events bulletin board kind of thing. In the wedding section, you guys have all seen these. I just didn't have them in the baby blue, the ribbon bows. I find, even though I have sons, when I do projects, I've been really into the, you know, the gorgeous girls and the girls, and I never even thought to get boy stuff. So when I was there, I was like, yeah, I get start getting some boy stuff. Uh, you guys have seen these when I got them. Nobody was out hauling them yet, but I got these for a friend. She knows who she is. She knows she's getting them. And they are so darling, I might have to get some for myself now. But anyway, those are for her. Look at her. Isn't she gorgeous? And then there's one other one I really like. Oh, yeah, the seahorse unicorn or narwhal. Anyway, I just love that one. So that is for her and her little package. This is another one. Okay, I actually got a lot. Um, this is the butterflies. So if you wanted to put this on a wall or on a project, this can make one butterfly. But I actually really like the side butterfly. I don't know. I'm really into that. So that's that one. And I broke down and got the lemons. You just never know when you need lemons. Lemons are so big right now. And I've always liked lemons even before they were big. But had to get those. And then I also got this one. This is a llama. I got that and really like these blue butterflies and look at how many I get and again this isn't for wall decor this is just for projects and stickers look at how many butterflies you get and they're in that really popular blue that's in right now so yes I got that and the two bags guys so just bear with me here Okay, I guess I got two of the blues. <laughs> I didn't even know that. I meant to get one. Um, the bridal embellishments in the silver. So I got those. And I can't remember. I think I might have got those already. Now, in the store, I the one store I go to, I think I've mentioned before, at the back of the store near the cleaning stuff, there is an end cap that they discount items. I always check it because you never know what you're going to find. And there was a lot of food stuff that wasn't expiring anytime soon, like granola bars and stuff. So I grabbed a bunch of that, but again, it's gone. But these were 50 cents. And I just got those for projects and to practice my coloring and stuff like that. Again, for when we're traveling, I just thought that's something I can do. Because sometimes I get, if I have big coloring, I get, I don't know, it's too much. You know, if you're camping or something. So this, I thought I could bring these 50 cents and just get them worked on. Um, I just got the buttons in the blue colors. And so you get blues and whites. So I got those. That might be a repurchase. Uh, I got the bridal embellishments in the, um, these are like the gold. I had already purchased these in the silver and decided to get them in the gold tones. Uh, I got the bows in the white this time because I found those. The other Dollar Tree in my last haul, they didn't have those yet. And I finally found the perfume bottles and ornaments. Like this one looks perfume bottles and these could work as Christmas tree ornaments. And then these look like the perfume bottles. So I got that set. I, I know you guys have all seen these. It's been so long since I've been able to get these up. But anyway those the bottles i love these bottles sorry about the glare and you've all seen these these cologne and perfume bottles so i just got those to add to my stickers oh and i guess i got one more grad pack i thought i only got one but i got two so to i'm shaky too much coffee already i guess 
So that is that uh, bag, and we're gonna get into my other bag. These are two, two different Dollar Tree. So this one was the Exeter store, and now we're getting into the London store, which the one London store uh, is not nearly as good as when I go to my Exeter store. So anyway, I found some glitter. Now, if any of you follow Ann Makes, she looks like, it looks like in her haul she got, to me it looks like all of them, and I actually messaged her to let me know if there's any colors that I'm missing, and I, I sort of did these in a rainbow so I can try and show you really quick. So, we'll start here. I got, um, they don't have a name, which really bugs me. Oh, no, they do. I'm sorry. They do. My friend asked me, and they didn't. I didn't think they did. Okay, so, Crushed Jewels. Dazzling metallics that's like a ruby red uh, Dorothy's ruby slippers so uh, I'll be definitely making some of those um, okay again no this one's called crushed jewels so and it's a different shade so yeah I'm not sure maybe they're just okay this one's princess dust but those crushed jewels these are two different like this is ruby red like think Dorothy's slippers and then this one is like a princess hot pink so they are different <clears throat> this one it says again dazzling metallics and it's it's a Christmas green. This one crushed jewels, yeah. See, I guess it's just the different types of glitter, but um anyway, this really cool green, uh a lighter green, and this one, yeah, princess dust. So I yeah, they're they're not really naming them, but anyway, this green I found it in gold. I wonder if there's a silver out there. If there is, I hope so. And then in the blues, I found this. And it's not really coming through on the camera. But anyway, that blue. Then I know it's hard to see on camera, but these are different shades of blue. Oh, I guess you can kind of see it. This one's a little bit lighter, and then this one's a little bit darker. And then we've got this blue, and then yet another lighter blue. So I got that. I have actually have a Martha Stewart one from Dollarama a few years back that's very close to this one. And then in the purples, I was only able to find this one. And then in this pink. And going back to the pinks, these are different pinks. This one's more of a pink pink, and then this one's more of like a, a hot pink. So that's what I found so far in these glitters for buck twenty-five to get ultra fine glitter. That's a steal. And they just show you different projects. Oops, sorry, on the box. And yes, I took the box because I thought it was really neat. They give you the little holes uh, to store them in so they don't tip. Uh, Anne Makes on her video actually found a container at the Dollar Tree that with the lids that snap. And she says they fit perfectly. My store only had red and I want a clear one. So once I find a clear one, I'll be doing the same as her. Thanks, Anne, for that tip. I found, just going to pull these out, these bird stencils. We all know I love my birds, so I got those. I found, yeah, I know, again, uh, everybody's been hauling this stuff, but anyway, I found the Canada stickers for any patriotic stuff, and I do love the lettering, the letters in this pack. So I got that. Let's try and keep all those stickers together. Um, I found these, and I thought these were super cool. They're an iridescent silver alphabet. See that? And I thought these are so cool. And I like the size. Like, they're a little bit... Oops, sorry about the glare there. Like, just at the tip of my baby finger. Or, yeah, just like the size. A little bit bigger than my fingernail. And they're called foil font stickers with shimmer. But, oh, I just love how they... Sorry, I'm blinding y'all. Stop. Okay, um... I've been married since 2003 and I've yet to do our wedding scrapbook because <laughs> the year after we got married I was working almost full time and then had got pregnant had a baby and yeah so it's been kind of put on the back plate other projects came but anyway hydrangeas were our wedding flower so when I saw these at Dollar Tree I had to get them for that project I found the gem stickers, a, they're called the gem stickers value pack. Look at how many you get guys, like this is a big pack. This one is silver, 
light pink and then oops, hot pink. Sorry if I'm blinding you, but that's a huge pack. And they're a nice small one. And then this one is, um, yeah, like clear or silver, whatever you want to call clear, I guess. And the pearl, again, nice size. Okay, I'm at 10%. Let's hopefully I can get this in. I'll just hurry along here. I got these cellulose sponges, not for cleaning, to do the glue in a, uh, again, you buy them at Dollar Tree, I already have one, a little snap small lunch container. You put this in and you dump glue on it and then you have like glue you can dab. Um, they're great for kids, they're great for projects, so that's what that's for. I thought about trying one with clear glue and one with white glue, just because there's two. And wrapping up the craft stuff, I just got these wood cutouts and the nautical, because I have some nautical paper, so when I thought these, I thought they were cool. So you get the, the brain's gone. I know my helpers will help me. Anyway, that, the, the actual sailboat and the anchor. I mostly got it for the two anchors and you get two of each. And lastly, I got buffs. I love these buffs in the summer in my hair. Uh, this, if you haven't bought these, these are awesome. <coughs> Excuse me. There's so many different ways you can wear them. I love these, even when we snowmobile. They're thin enough to go under my helmet to cover up my face, things like that. Even though I have a, a plug-in helmet, sometimes, I don't know, my husband says I don't, don't breathe properly. Because <laughs> he never, he can wear a helmet even without the defogging uh, cord in his helmet and never fog up. I fog up even with the defogging horn. So I uh, sometimes use these to help. Uh, I hate being fogged up when I snowmobile. Anyway, so I got this one in these, of course, these hot pink, purples, and black. And these, who makes these? Imported by Greenbrier. Um, anyway, so that co those colors right there, just love those. And then I got it in the camo. I love camo. So, yes. So that concludes my, yep, my Dollar Tree haul for today. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you all have a wonderful day. Take care, guys. Bye.